Well, since this laptop is dead, I figure I'll harvest some parts from it. Yay. How about the battery? Not. This battery lasted about 15 minutes when I used it. Lithium ion, that's why. There you go. RN. Recycle North. That's where I got the thing. <sighs> so, we can explore this thing now and not have to worry about things breaking. I guess it was only a matter of time before this thing broke. It's a shame. This is the module for the 56K modem. Now this module, now this is the module you could you could replace and it would make either the modem work or the ethernet port work or both work at the same time. Now I have the module that only works with the modem right here. So yeah. I guess we'll unplug that. And, uh, wow, did <laughs> you see that? The paper ripped right off. Whatever, this thing's dead anyway, I don't care. Take the metal off. Let's take a look at the card, since it's, you know. Here's a, what a, mo here's a modem module card. It's wrapped in paper. IBM. Interesting. Industry Canada. That's different. This IBM PCI modem with voice may be connected to the telecom network. Well, that's nice. It's Japan made. Huh. That's where it went. Now let's take a look at the RAM. There's the product key. Except you can't really see it. It's for Windows 2000 anyway. Microsoft probably won't even care because 2000 is pretty outdated. They don't even support it anymore. I can take off the door, which has the product key on it. That's pretty nice. There's the RAM. Yay. Korean-made Samsung RAM. Which is actually buffered. Wow. There's a little buffering thing right there. Look at that. Semi-buffered. These are semi-buffered DIMMs, apparently. Or SIMs. DIMMs. Whatever. Whatever they are. There we are. IBM RAM. Actual IBM RAM and Samsung RAM, so they're mismatched. There you go. Yeah, this computer just suddenly decided to quit. It doesn't even power on. Like, normally, if there was a hardware problem, it would go into the BIOS and go, beep, 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 there's something wrong with your computer, do something about it right now. You know. It just panicked or something. But All right, now let's take out the brand new hard drive that was in it. That makes me sad. But I get an 80 gig... Fucking screw. The screw is too small. The screwdriver is not going to work. I need a bigger one. Oh, yeah. There's always a stubborn screw. I swear to God. All right. All right. I got the big screwdriver. Stubborn screws are pieces of shit. Ah. There we go. That little... You, sir, are a piece of shit. <laughs> yes, I insult everything that annoys me. Pull the hard drive out. There we go. See how new this is? 80 gigabytes. IDE. The good news is I have an enclosure, so I can reuse this drive if I have to. In fact, I probably am going to reuse it. There's the floppy. I don't know if I can take that out. I don't think I can. All right. And I can take the CD drive out. I know I can do that. So let's take the screws out of here. Take a look at the CD drive. I'm probably going to steal the screws, use them as spare parts, and uh, send this laptop off to the recycling or the garbage.
The garbage would be more satisfying. <laughs> and we pull this to the side. That lever to the side. And which moves that screw hole over. So that's what that screw locks. It locks this thing. Move this out. Move this out. Press it. Move this out. Uh, how the hell do you do this? And I guess you pull it out. Yep. There's the DVD drive. Or CD drive, rather. It's an IBM CD drive. Manufactured in New York. So it's a USA-made drive. There you go. No wonder it's lasted this long. Oh, what? It's an LG drive. Wow. Made in Korea. It's Korean made. I lied. It was manufactured in New York. I'm sorry. But as you can see there, it's 24x reading speed. <laughs> Very slow. August 2000. <laughs> this thing's an old bastard, but it still works. So I'm going to give it a happy home on eBay or Craigslist. Or just keep it for parts. I don't know. It has little screws in it. It has little screws in it that are could be very useful actually. So I might keep keep this drive. So I got the C D drive out. Yeah, you can't really see in there, so I'll just show you the slot on the back. These drives take uh what looks like a SCSI slot. <laughs> yeah, it looks it looks kinda like SCSI to me. I don't know. It could be serial. It could be uh some sort of serial port, I'm not sure. The optional PS2 ports. <laughs> no, actually, these are S-Video ports. Optional S-Video ports for higher-end models, it looks like. There's the PCI card slot. I got everything out of there. The floppy drive, I don't think I can take out. I can take... I th actually, you might, I might be able to take it out. I'm not sure. I have no idea, but yeah. I've got all the parts that I, uh, I got all the removable parts out of it. Next thing I'm going to do is just take this, is just steal all the screws <laughs> and then uh, send this thing off. So let's give this thing one last look over because I probably won't ever see it again. Docking station port. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. One last look at the inside. You were a good computer. I'm going to miss this thing. I liked it when I used it. Bye-bye, my friend. You were useful. See you later. All right, that's enough of uh, <laughs> worshiping this dead computer, so. Cats. Cats, 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 c